Hey guys, Brooks here at Pop Spot. How did the presidential election get me to this guy and 50 bags of beef jerky? Let's find out as we get lost on the internet. So the election is over, the campaigns have ended, and everyone's concerned about the road ahead. But one thing's for sure, this guy is gonna do some serious aging. So I learned that presidents live longer than the average life expectancy because they're better educated, wealthier, and have better health care. But these two dermatologist ladies make an interesting point. Studies prove that presidents age twice as fast as mere mortals. Now that's got to be true because these ladies invented Proactive, the skin treatment that's cool for teens because kids like Bieber say so. It's pretty chill. So those ladies said that George W. Bush did the worst aging. In his eight years, he almost aged 20. Mm. You can really see a different man as he left the big chair. I had to check out more presidents aging. It looks like Carter got it pretty bad, but the sun beating down on his face doesn't help much. Even cooler are time-lapse videos where the people age right in front of you. Hair growth videos are also popular, like this guy who appears to make his hair grow with his hand. Turns out they shot this backwards while they cut his hair along the way. It's a really good stop motion though. It's like Gautier meets uh, Michael J. Fox's Teen Wolf. Okay, so now I'm lost in time lapse videos. I'm watching a starfish flip over. I didn't even know they do that. Bunch of ants running up and eating a dead gecko on someone's kitchen table. Then someone drawing a picture of Harry Styles from One Direction. But there's no way that's a kid's real name, right? It turns out a British fan posted his birth certificate on Twitter this summer to prove that is his real name. But Harry's mom made her take it down right away because she was like weirded out that she got the birth certificate. Actually, birth certificates are public record in the UK, so it's not even that sketchy. So they're done drawing that picture and a coworker tells me I've got to watch time lapse of uh, crystal meth addicts. Wow, is that depressing. This one nice looking lady literally turned herself into Keith Richards. Now that pic was actually already used to compare Keith to something else, not a meth addict, but a 3,000 year old mummy. And over at totallylooksike.com, there's plenty of comparisons for him, like a Sphinx cat, a Freddy Krueger, even a pound of ground beef. Which reminds me, there's a time lapse for that too. And in the related videos, there's a time lapse using beef jerky to create portraits of Obama and Romney. Introducing Barack Obama and meet Romney. That guy used 50 bags of beef jerky to do that. And Romney's skin color isn't so far off as long as you Google best Romney tan. Last thing I learned today, protein is essential for good skin and healthy aging. So hopefully the White House puts some beef jerky on the menu. Uh, you guys like beef jerky? How do you think Obama has aged in the last four years? Let us know in the comments below, and as always, tell us what kind of stuff you find when you get lost. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to subscribe to Pop Spot if you haven't already, and check out our other shows while you're at it. And we'll see you here every Wednesday when we get lost on the internet.